Hello, in this session we will explore HBase architecture more in detail. HBase contains three important components, HMaster, Region Server and Zookeeper. HMaster assigns regions to region servers for load balancing in Hadoop cluster and perform two important activities. One, manage and monitor Hadoop cluster, act as an interface to perform some of the DDL operations such as create, update, delete, table operations. DDL or data definition language operations are only performed by the hedge master, but it doesn't involve in data manipulation activities. For any schema changes or metadata changes, HBase hedge master is responsible. It controls the failover. The second component in the architecture is region server. And this is the most important component in the cluster. These are actually a worker nodes or also called a slave nodes. They actually perform read, write, update, delete operations to the actual data of a table. The region server executes and process the client request quests within the data node in the Hadoop cluster. Generally, there would be one region for a table. When the rows get added and the size becomes bigger and bigger, and that is the point, a region becomes two or more regions. And that's how the number of regions get grow up in the, in the region server. And the next one, within the region server, there are four other important components. One is a block cache, mem store, write ahead log, and a hedge file. What is a block cache? Block cache is also called a read cache. Most frequently or most often, oftenly accessed data is stored in this cache to avoid the unnecessary load. If a block cache is full, the previously used data will be removed. Mem store. Memstore is like a block cache which actually stores the write cache. It stores a very latest data which is yet to return to the hard disk. Every column family in a region has memstore. Write ahead log. Before data is actually written into hard disk, it stores in the form of logs and then pushes into the hard disk. It persists such a new data that is not yet written to the hard disk. In the event of server failure, it helps you to recover the data in this particular transition, in this particular a slight window of the failure. Next, H file. This is the actual file which stores the table data in the sorted as a key value pair. The file is an indexed file. And the third component in the architecture is a zookeeper. Zookeeper is a distributed coordination service for region assignments to the region server. It is a centralized monitoring server, server that holds configuration information as well as provides a distributed synchronized information. Client first approaches zookeeper with a new request and zookeeper routes it through region servers. Hmaster and region servers are registered with the zookeeper. In case a node fails in HBase, Zookeeper quorum triggers error message and start repair activities. It tracks region servers, their pulse, which region holds which data nodes kind of information. HMaster contains contacts Zookeeper to get the details of the region servers. Overall services of a Zookeeper is establish client communication with the region server, track server failure and network partitions, and maintain configuration information. That's all in the session for HBase master architecture.